and three in Cincinnati, and the Reds want to wrap it up in a hurry. This time, Pittsburgh scores first. A single by Clemente. And after a walk to Stargell, another hit by Al Oliver for the run. Bob Moose gets the call, and the Reds charge right back. A home run by Perez. Johnny Bench up next puts Cincinnati ahead with still another blast. Moose, unshaken by those homers, retired 13 in a row, and it was 2-2 two two in the last of the eighth. Then Ty Klein, a first game hero, led off with a walk, and Pete Rose moved him up with a single. The Pirates switch to left-handed Bob Gibbon, but Tolan slices a single to left, and Klein races over with the tie-breaking run. To protect the lead, the Reds call on young Don Gullett, and Al Oliver's ground ball closes out the series. So the Big Red Machine wins a pennant for the first time in nine years. A totally reconstructed team with a rookie manager and a cast of young stars. A team that would go into the World Series with a crippled pitching staff and never alibi its loss. <laughs>